Labas vakaras, gyvenamoji publika. Džiaugiamės matyti jūs čia, mūsų akademijos salėje. Ne susigundžiusius kaziuko mūgė, kuri čia pat už langų šurmuliuoja, nepabūgusius žvarbaus oro ir šiaip besidominčius chorinę muziką. Lietuvos muzikos ir teatro akademijos choras šiandien jums pristatys, ką tik naujai iškeptą programą Lietuvos, atsiprašau, Lenkijos šilaikinės chorinės muzikos kūrinių programą, kuri buvo parašta tris dienas trukusiuose meistriškumo kursuose. Joje dalyvavo taip pat aktyvus dirigentai choro dirigavimo katedros, kurios išvysite ir šį vakarą prieš chorą. Na, o kursams vadovavo viešnė iš Lenkijos, kuri šiek tiek pristatys ir kiekvieną kūrinį ir leiskite tuomet perduoti žodį jai ir pasveikinkime Broclovo Karolio Lipinskio akademijos ir Varšovo Šofeno universiteto profesorė, habilituotą daktarė Agnieška Frankov Želazdį. Dobry wieczór. Good evening. Good afternoon, actually, because it's quite light outside. First of all, I'd like to say that I'm very, very happy to be there and very honored to work for last few days with such a talented young people, talented singers and talented conductors. It was a big honor for me and big pleasure. Thank you so much for invitation and thank you so much for being such, so open during all those time, all this time. I'm, I'd like to tell you a few words before each piece to tell you a little bit more about music I chose for this masterclass. And I chose Polish music, Polish composers, um, uh, compositions which was composed in 21st century. Um, only one of those composers uh, are not, is not alive. It's Krzysztof Penderecki who unfortunately passed uh, two years ago. The rest of them are, are living composers and they are very happy they sent you uh, their greetings to Vilnius, to uh, Lithuanian uh, Academy, and uh, I, I'm sure they, some of them, listen to us now. We will start uh, with a piece in Polish, which is very, very meaningful because it starts with words uh, very good for opening this concert. Chciałbym zaśpiewać ci. It means I'd like to sing for you. And of course, in the middle of this piece, there are a lot of happened because um, the, it's about life, like, like everyone, um, life, we had diff have different colors of our life. Sometimes we are full of joy and sometimes not. But anyway, we'd like always to sing and that's our, I think, credo. Uh, and we can be happy being here and might sing. And you, I think, might be happy to listen to the singing and to create the singing in different, from different side. Chciałbym zaśpiewać ci by Marek Raczyński. Dirigoja Gabrielius Gaidamavičius.
next piece is composed by Michał Zieliński. He's from Bydgoszcz and is professor of theory of music, but singers and composers as well. Laudate Dominum, David Salm, number 117. Dirigoja Neringa Sudaugaitė, solistė Augustė Andrijauskaitė. next pieces. First of them, Ubi Caritas, composed by Paweł Łukaszewski, professor of Chopin University, a music university in uh, Warsaw. Uh, I think I don't, don't have to translate this text. Everyone, especially today, understands what does it mean. 
Caritas is all around us and it's so important today. And I'm sure uh, we all remember about that, but since last day we remember about it even more. So Ubi Caritas by Paweł Łukaszewski and just after, after it, Pije Jezu, composed by a student of Paweł Łukaszewski, Łukasz Farcinkiewicz. Actually, Łukasz has already graduated composition, but um, he used to be a student. Uh, beautiful, uh, beautiful touching phrase, musical phrase uh, with piano and uh, with Professor Gintauta Zbenislovas on piano and beautiful solo. So two next pieces. Dirigoja profesor Agnieszka Franko Zelazny o antrame kūrinė pie Jėzų solo dainuos Jėvas Korupskaitė.
species, species is very special. Um, not because it's uh, Psalm, uh, David's Psalm number 130, De profundis clamavi domine, exaudi orationem meam. Maybe it's the best prayer for today, but I think it's always very good pr pr prayer, especially uh, with, uh, in this musical arrangement by Marcin Łukaszewski, the brother of Paweł. Uh, we can pray in so many different colors. We can express our feelings in so many different colors. And in this particular piece, everything is included. Every single color of, and every single emotion. So next piece, De Profundis by Marcin Łukaszewski. Dirigoje Justyna Linartaite, solo Augustė Andriauskaite.
o Gloriosa Virginu. This is next piece, composed by Krzysztof Penderecki. Krzysztof Penderecki is well known, oh. I think, after Frederick Chopin, a second or maybe on the same level, well-known compo Polish composer. Um, and he loved choir singing. In each his oratorio, oratorial big piece, in almost each one, include, included at least one a cappella uh, movement. Uh, that's why uh, there are so many possibilities to sing his um, pieces by choir. But this one, this particular one, is a separate piece written especially for a cappella choir in the very last time, last period of composing style by Krzysztof Penderecki. We all know that in the second part of 20th century he was in a representative kind of avant-garde, um, Polish music avant-garde, so um, uh, there are several very difficult, very not obvious choral um, pieces, but this one is rather in this classical way of composing. And next to Missa Brevis, there are one of his last, uh, last pieces for a cappella choir. O Gloriosa Virginum by Krzysztof Penderecki. Trigoja Povilas Vanjodis.
the text of next two compositions comes from the Song of Songs, Canticum Canticorum, very beautiful part of Bible, and um, we will hear two compositions and two fragments of this text. First uh, is composed by uh, already known uh, for you, composer Łukasz Farcinkiewicz, Kwem Diligit Anima Mea. And uh, the second one is uh, composed by Miłosz Bębinow. Both of those composers work in uh, Warsaw, um, uh, Frederick Chopin Uni Music University, and, uh, and both of them understand this text, uh, this meaning of uh, the love which is described into Canticum Canticorum as a love between uh, human love. So love between man and woman. Quem diligit anima mea, first text. Uh, and the second one, vulnerasti con cor meum. You charmed my heart, you delighted my heart. The one I think of the most well-known te well text and with beautiful arran musical arrangement, arrangement by Miłosz Bębinow. So, two pieces from Canticum Canticorum. Pirmai dirigos Sandra Bareikaitė, taip pat toliau dirigos Monika Grigaitytė ir solo dainos Gabrielius Gaidamavičius ir Paulas Vandžutis.
very last piece during tonight's concert is special from three reasons, at least. One is because of composer. Jan Krutl is, I think, the most positive and the most optimistic person I know. And um, he writes a lot of wonderful music uh, for kids, for example, um, but also for adults and vocal instrumental. It's young composer and very, very full of uh, great ideas. And I'm sure you will hear about him many times. Second reason is text. Very, very special. And, you know, it's a sign because we didn't know choosing those pieces that it will suit so much for today. Let me read the text for you. Um, I, only, I, I only mentioned that uh, it's this piece was part, and this piece and the first one, Chciałbym Zaśpiewać Ci, was the past part of project. I invited 12 composers to write piece um, admiring singing about singing, and they chose, uh, chose different texts that they decided how they'd like to express their um, feeling and they uh, love to singing. And Jan Krutul chose the text by uh, John Paul II uh, and made kind of mixture of this text. And uh, please listen what um, we will present you in this music. When you start to sing, you make something new. When you, you, when you sing together, something new gets created in you. So raise your soul. Let's sing together. Open up your heart. Let your singing transcend the borders. With the power of your art, you can open up your heart. You can open up your listeners. You can reach the depth of existence. So, let your singing transcend the borders. You are sent to spread God's joy. Walk through the world with a message of peace. Let's sing, let's demonstrate that faith is stronger than doubt, that hope is stronger than despair, that love is stronger than death. Let your singing transcend the borders. You are messengers of peace and joy. And the third reason uh, why this piece is special and why it will be special for you, I hope, tonight, is because I'd like to ask you to join us during uh, performing this piece. If there are no borders, as we agreed all, it's not only about the borders bec between countries. I, I believe that the main borders are in our minds. So, please, don't think that there is any border here. We are all one ensemble, one big choir. If you'd like to join us using your hand, hands and clapping, uh, when I will ask you to clap and stop when the choir will stop, uh, it would be great end of our together concert today. So let your singing, trans our singing, transcend the border, borders by Jan Krutul. Thank you. 
viso choro vardu, taip pat ir mūsų choro dirigavimo katedros visos vardu. Noriu padėkoti gerbiamai profesoriai už jos išties tokį nuoširdų dalymas į savo patirtimi, savo žiniomis ir savo šviesą mums ir savo pristatytą programą. Tikrai esam labai laimingi ir didžiulis, didžiulis ačiū. And on the behalf of all active members of this master class, uh, we would like to give a memento for you. And on that memento, a useful thing, you will find it useful for your everyday activities. We have left a small message that we took from, yours, from you. Uh, we have recorded one of your phrases that you told us, and we thought it is important. It was the most important phrase of this whole masterclass, so you will find it on that very useful item. <laughs> <laughs> 